I'm Anil Kumar and in this video we will learn a technique to write numbers as exponents. Now here we will use prime factorization. It is a very important technique and it really helps us to write factors of a number and then write the number as exponent of another number. We'll see that just in a minute. The question here is write each of the following as an exponent of a number 121, 32, 81, 64. These are very common numbers which you are always going to work with. So let's work with 125 first. So 125 will do prime factorization. You can divide 125 by 5. So 5 is one of the factors. So if I divide by 5, I get 5 times 2 is 10, 25, 5 times 5. And then we can do prime factorization of 25. 25 is 5 times 5, correct? And therefore, we can write 25 as 5 times 5 times 5. And in the exponent form, we can write 25 is equals to the base is 5, 5 is the base, and exponent is 3. So 5 to the power of 3 is 125. Do you get the point? So that is the process which we need to follow. I'd like you to pause the video and answer the rest of the questions. Here is the solution for 32. So let's begin by writing prime factors of 32. Keep on dividing by 2. So 2, half of 32 is 16. Then again, 2, 2 times 8 is 16. 2 times 4 is 8 and 2 times 2 is 4. So we can write 32 as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 twos, right? It's product of these 5 twos, correct? So what do we get here? We get base as 2, so in this case we can write this as 2 is the base, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, exponent is 5. So 2 to the power of 5 is indeed 32, right? Let's do another one. 81, okay. So 81 is uh, 9 times 9 is 81, you know that. So we can also write 81 as 9 square, right? 9 times 9. Okay, let's further divide 9's. So 3 times 3 is 9, 3 times 3 is 9. So how many 3's? 4 3's. So we can also write this as 3 to the power of 4. 3 times 3 times 3 times 3. Do you see that? So prime factorization is an excellent technique to find factors and then write the answer as exponent of a base. 64 this time, the last number for us is 64. We can divide by 2, so we get 2, half of 64 is 32. We did 32 already and we know what is 32. 32 is 2 to the power of 5, right? Here we are, so you can repeat all this. So 64 I can write as 2 times 2 to the power of 5. 2 times 2 to the power of 5 or 2 to the power of 6. So like this, we can write down 64. There are many different ways in which you can write 64 as. As power of 4. Try that out, okay? I hope you are enjoying this and you have learned a lot. Thank you and all the best.